Now, new guidelines are being issued to stop doctors missing cow's milk allergies in infants. Well, joining me now are Mum Lucy Ronker and her children George, and they're right at the front of my desk, the delicious Iris, who will do whatever she chooses to do over the next couple of minutes. Skin, yeah. rashes, vomiting, upset stomach, constipation, wind, reflux, colic. And you're feeling pretty fit. You're looking pretty fit. What's she like, who's now on the desk? Does she... <laughs> she has to avoid the... You're all right, you just carry on there. And so she can't have the milk either. Really concerned about as a parent is making sure that at a young age they're getting the calcium that they need. Yeah. Um, so that was one of the things that actually, when we were finally referred into the hospital, having that support when weaning to making sure that they were getting the right food was absolutely crucial. And thank you very much indeed, all of you, for coming in. <laughs> now, football and <laughs> just a few moments, Wayne Rooney, you stay right where you are. <laughs> has announced his retirement from international football. And that's it this lunchtime. Mary Nightingale, I think we'll have a more peaceful time at 6.30. But from all of us, a very good afternoon to you. Bye-bye. <laughs>